All right, this is Ronnie Boy. I got to live up to a promise I made before. Uh, I kind of forgot about it. We didn't have any so many chores to do, but uh, this being Sunday, I took a little extra time. I thought about it again. Uh, I, I promised you I'd give you one of my recipes. This is sort of my Wisconsin Farms Kitchen's recipe book. I, I did this myself. That's not my farm, but it's one that's nearby here. I thought it was so pretty. I put it on the cover. Got a cow on the back. But these are all my recipes that I uh, uh, use all the time. And rather instead of uh, digging through a box every time I want to make something, I put them all in a book. Then they're right there. I use them all the time, and they're my recipes. I, I might have taken an idea from other recipes, then I made up my own though. Uh, I had to combine a couple different uh, some different ideas. Uh, I, I like to cook, but okay. Make so this video don't get too long. I, I'll give you my blueberry muffin recipe. I like to call it Ronnie Boy's blueberry muffins, but uh, you can call it Ronnie's muffins if you want to. Okay, okay. The ingredients: one cup all-purpose flour, three quarters cup sugar, one teaspoon, one, one tablespoon baking powder, two egg whites, not the yolks, just the whites, you can do what you want with the yolks, uh, third cup unsweetened applesauce, three quarters cup whole wheat pastry flour, one te teaspoon finely shredded lemon peel, two thirds cup buttermilk, that's important, uh, teaspoon of vanilla, uh, and uh, one cup fresh frozen blueberries. Do not thaw them. Leave them frozen. Okay. Now here's what you do. You preheat the oven to 400 degrees. And uh, spray six large three-inch muffin cups with no stick spray and set aside. In a large bowl, stir together the all-purpose flour, whole wheat flour, the sugar, baking powder, and lemon peel. Make a well in the center of the mixture. Then in a small bowl, beat the egg whites until foamy. Stir in the buttermilk, applesauce, and vanilla. Add the buttermilk mixture to the flour mixture and stir just until moistened. Fold in the blueberries. Then you mix it up. You don't want to mix it too much. Otherwise, um, your muffins won't be that fluffy kind of thing if you make it too smooth. Just so it's mixed is really all you have to do. Spoon the batter into the prepared cups. Fill in each three quarters full. Bake for 22 to 25 minutes or until a toothpick inserted in the center comes out clean. Well, I never had much luck with that. I usually take a thing out and see if it's done inside, but uh, then you ruin the muffin. But Anyway, cool the muffins in the muffin cups for five minutes. Then move the muffins to a cool to cool on a wire rack. This makes like six six large muffins, something like that. Now to make standard size muffins, spray twelve two and a half inch muffin cups with no stick spray. Spoon the batter in the cups, filling each three quarters full. Bake for eighteen to twenty minutes or until done. And cool as directed above. Easy as pie. But they're excellent. They're very, very good. My mom 91 years old and she makes them all the time uh, she's got one of my recipe books that says how do you make them recipe so easy to do you know what I should do I should I, I talked about having a contest I should have a contest and give away one of my recipe books I should put my picture on the front <laughs> picture me hauling out manure eating a muffin <laughs> anyway that's my recipe and I uh, hope you enjoy it. Uh, if you didn't get it all that time, you have to watch my video again and again and again until you get it. <laughs> okay. Lonnie Boy saying goodbye for now.